Hey guys, another set of video which says about um, alphabets and it's like all the language. So the activity sheets are all based on language and let's see what we have. Okay, so I have used like again the colored sheets and uh, I've used these stickers and I have used some of my um, stickers from my sticker book. So nothing very, so no printouts basically and a lot of things done by hand or a lot of things which you, you, you would already have at home. Okay, so, so number one, which is, um, this is a very, very funny game. I don't know if uh, any, any one of you have tried this. So I, I thought I will try it for the first time. So what I've done, I have like written A and A here, C and C here. So you have E here and you have E here. So you have to make a line like this. Basically, you have like one line here and one line here and you have to just make, uh, you have to just join like A and A or capital letter or small A or some words matching. So what I've done, I have like... <laughs> just done it a little different way so i have like three g's here so once Vivan is connecting the g he has to take one line here and he needs to take one line here so b and b needs to go here e has to go all the way here so i think it's gonna be like little fun and i've used these stickers and with the marker i have like put the alphabets you can also do it just to make it a little more fun uh so that's my activity number one okay so my next activity is um tracing of course he needs to if we are like <laughs> working day in and day out on pre-writing and uh, i have like taken three alphabets l t and b and i put my dots so he needs to connect the dots and he makes two uh, he needs to make the alphabet so i have just uh, there are just three of them for him to do because otherwise if you tell him to make like more than five or six he gets very restless and uh, he gets very upset so I thought just to make him happy, let him just do three at one time. So three L and then three T, the three B. And uh, yeah, so that's about it. So that's one of our pre-writing activity. And uh, okay, so that's Vivan. <laughs> that's V-I-V-A-N. -A My son wants to just write his name. Nothing else. If you tell him to write it on the paper, he'll write it. If you tell him to write it on a book, wherein which is from the school, or if I tell him to write V or I, he'd say, I don't know, Mama. I don't know how to write. So uh, just to make him happy and uh, to keep him like super excited, I have written his name with the dots, and he has to just connect and do it. And then to make the V, I have put like three dots here. So he needs to just make two slanting lines to make the V. So again, we have we'll be doing three of them. And he needs to do this, uh, which is connect dots. And this is something which he needs to do it on his own. And yes, of course, there's a little smiley face for him to see. So once he's doing an activity, let him be a little happy also. Okay, so uh, going forward, we have... Um, so here he needs to match the alphabet with the... Uh, with a picture which starts with that alphabet so it's like cherry so we have c here we have apple so we have a, a, a apple so then we have hand so ha ha hand so with a sound and then for watermelon we have w here so he needs to match them and he needs to identify the sound okay so that's like the matching activity with all these stickers so i had these stickers like randomly at my place and uh, these are all my like very very old stocks you would have seen it in many of my activities i try and use them again and again uh, if they are pasting once then i try and remove it if the activity is already done so that i can repaste it again <laughs> okay okay so what's next there is another pre-writing activity I have, which is C. So he needs to circle the things which start from C here, which is a cat and cherry. He needs to circle that. And then he needs to make C here. I have already made the dots for him. So he needs to do uh, just, he needs to connect the dots and make C. Okay, so we have... Um, Okay, so we have this uh, activity which I've uh, made for Vivan. I've used my sticker book and the, like beautiful stickers inside the sticker book. So I've taken a parrot, a crocodile, turtle and a frog. And there are these three options here. So he needs to just see that if it's a parrot, he needs to tick on the P. And he doesn't need to do anything with this. And if it's an alligator or a crocodile, it's a crocodile. So he can like tick C here. If it's a turtle, he'll find where is T, where is T, oh, it's T here. So he'll tick here. And then where's frog? The frog is hopping to F. So that's it. That's here. 
okay so uh, it was it was very tiring to make all the activities like in one day and like to keep it for stock so i have like done uh, the maths activity separately and the english language activity separately okay here what i've done i've taken a simple paper again and i've pasted a lot of vegetable pictures and uh, he will be picking up the alphabets so he needs to see the first sound and then he needs to take it up from here so like you have like t -t tomato so he needs to pick up t here and put it right here oops here so like this you have cucumber sorry you have zucchini you have cucumber you have asparagus you have pepper so like this he needs to match okay so another one which we have here is again he needs to match the fruit with the alphabet which starts with like olives with o and features p and m m melon so that's one and the last is to uh, connect capital and small so i have like i t y x a i have made it with the stencil which i had and he needs to connect it with a small so uppercase and small case connection that's it guys i think it's a very hands on activity which i have prepared for vivan i hope you like it do let me know your feedback thanks for watching see you